மார்னிங் ஐயா கோயம்புத்தூர் திருமூலர் சித்தர்பீடம் சிவயோகி சிவராஜன் ஸ்பீக்கிங் நவ் ஐ ஆம் கோயிங் டு எக்ஸ்பிளைன் த ஸ்டோரி பிஹைண்ட் நடராஜா காஸ்மிக் டான்ஸ் ஆஃப் சிவா நவ் மெனி பர்சன்ஸ் ஆர் ஷோயிங் இன்ட்ரெஸ்ட் டு நோ த சீக்ரெட் பிஹைண்ட் லார்ட் நடராஜாஸ் ஐடல் not lord nandrajas dance they want to know the geometry in the idol they want to know the philosophy in the idol physicists are also interested in knowing about this dance this dance is the causal dance create creates destroys resolution there is no destruction resolution preservation veiling and the revealing five fold activities are explained by the idol statue and a lot of big bang theory is there time travel theory is there five element energy rotation theory is there the explanation of uh, static energy and dynamic energy is there a lot of things are explained in that idol in fact this statue speaks of all these things the statue speaks of geometry physics cosmology big bang theory the energy rotation theory the significance of mandras how see shiva is the total energy form c for potential energy shiva and va for kinetic energy all the shakti so the very word shiva is representing energy final energy at rest and the energy at work so in this context the modern society is very much interested to know only the science behind everything if you want to know the reality one should pay attention to science as well as spirituality religious principles then only you will get a comprehensive view of all this principles in nataraja dance the modern society is not ready to accept the religious or spiritual portion they are ready to accept the science but both are equally important this is stressed by the famous scientist einstein so you can take it as an advice of the well known scientist einstein he says religion without science science is blind and science without religion is lame this this is key a catch word one should understand the modern society should accept this he is the authority to say he says that one should equally respect science and spirituality but in my opinion you have to give first preference to spirituality and then to science because the cause behind this nataraja idol is a religion spirituality the science has endorsed only after 2004 in zan zee or in zan switzerland geneva they conducted research on this and found out the truth behind that only partial truth so now people are interested in the on the findings of 2004 from zr but who invented this who discovered this very very age old even at the age of tirumula even at the age of this uh, 
மொஹஞ்சதர ஹரப்பா பீரியட் தீஸ் ஸ்டேச்சு சிதம்பர ஸ்டேச்சு இஸ்தே நடராஜா ஸ்டேச்சு இஸ்தே பிகாஸ் திருமூலர் ஹேஸ் எக்ஸ்பிளைன்ட் அபவுட் திஸ் நடராஜா டான்ஸ் இன் ஜீஸ் திருமந்திரம் வெரி கோல்டஸ்ட் இன் இன் ரிலிஜியஸ் அண்ட் ஸ்பிரிச்சுவல் லிட்ரேச்சர் சைவ சித்தாந்தா so first of all you have to find out the spiritual significance who installed the idol what's the period of this installation of the idol very very important more than the science portion because the tamils are the oldest race in the world some say even 7000 years back only tamil race was there all over the world in india even before mohanjadara harappa civilization only the tamil occupied the whole of india after the advent of this aryan society they they were sent back or forced back or they receded to the south that is behind this vindya sapura and that then these other languages like malayalam telugu kannadam came out of the mixture of sanskrit and tamil and finally the present tamil nadu is there so this oldest race we can know this is the oldest that even now this oldest the excavations have been done by this society and it confirms that the tamils are the oldest race in the world these references are there in the tamil literature also so they had a deep intuition the tamil race has a track trail so slowly slowly improvement improvement coming 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 and they found out and it gave you a real expression 100% expression for that energy which rules the world creates rules dissolves lifts the atman from ignorance and accepts the atman with it these are the five fold activities in this in this uh, statue many persons are th- speaking about only three three portions creation reservation and destroy no destroy dissolution then veiling and revealing mageswara and sadashiva five fold activities are in saiva siddhanta this is panja kritiya dance more or many things are there even time travel is represented by the snake the male and female portion is in shiva that is explained by these earrings and he lifts the atman everything in a lot of principles are there you have to study very closely and very carefully because the geometry is involved the cosmology physics engineering finally the truth now i want to explain the history behind this nataraja idol history is also very but whether you believe or not to meet uh, there you, you hear about ramayana many persons say it is a myth uh, it is not a tell me it is part of history ayodhya is there sri lanka is there all the places are here yeah, yeah, so this is this is history the poets have written it with some imagination says a bit fancy some attraction from allegory metaphors then people who oh, this is myth no it is part of history for your reading for creating curiosity they have added some ingredients to boost up that spiritual power as such there is a history in behind this nataraja idol people should understand the idol was first placed in tillai what is tillai tillai is the center of the universe even the nasa scientists are accepting this they are wondering how the oldest race tamil found out this is the meridian 
which is suitable for the dams. The place he places is a big toe, is exact center of the universe, confirmed, explained by NASA scientists. And how could they found out? Because of their intuition. They found out this idol because out of their intuition, deep intuition. Our God has blessed. God gave a darshan. Both are here. As a part of history, the dance occurred in Tillai forest in the first instance. In the Tillai forest, the minimum sagas. In Hinduism, there are six systems of philosophy, out of which one is Mimamsaka. That is, they believe that everything can be created, preserved and destroyed through homas, rituals and Vedic chanting. A group of people were there. They were called Mimamsakas. They conducted Homa in that, in Tillai, and they claimed that they are the gods. Then Shiva appeared before them and told, I am all in all, I am the final energy. I assume human form to cater to the needs of the devotees and public. But these fellows are not ready to accept Shiva as the final energy and final souls. This is souls, means and the end. They are not ready to accept. So, they created one, um, out of this is a home on fire, they created one tiger and directed to a Shiva to attack him. He, with this little nail, he tore up the skin and weared. That is how the tiger skin comes. Before that, no tiger skin. People say, why Christian people and other people, why is Shiva is wearing tiger, why is snake? This is how tiger skin came. When somebody attacks with a stone, you take the stone and build a, get a building. The same way they send a tiger, he killed it and tear them and used as his robe. This is the first instant the tiger skin comes before that, no tiger skin. Then they created this one poisonous egg from the fire and directed it to a Shiva. He cut it and wear as his ornament. This is a starting point for wearing the snake. Why he is wearing it? Before that, no snake. Only after he, the, the, the enemies attacked him. He made the minus negative energy into the positive energy and war. It is a dangerous thing. But when it comes to the final energy, nothing. It becomes nothing. Yes, he is the creator of this snake. Why should he fear about that? Ordinary man fears because he, he has to fear. But he is a composing person of all these dances. Every creature is uh, dancing to his tune because he is a creator. Weird it is strong. That is how the snake came to Shiva. Shiva is the final energy for the convenient, for blessing the devotees and teaching the devotees. He assumes a human form. This is Aguna Murta. Many people criticize uh, idolatry. No idolatry. This is the second form of worship in Hinduism. First is astral. And for this, this snake, now this snake represents the time travel. Then in the final attempt, they send one Asura called Moyalakan to attack Shiva. And he is dancing, breaking the backbone of that Asura. So somebody says, yeah, man lying, not man, Asura. He has broken the backbone and this asura is equated with this ignorance. So, ignorance is the cause of anava. 
So if you break the backbone of even our ego, then only knowledge will come. Then only you will be elevated. Then only you, you will express the divine qualities in you. If you kill or if you subdue, because he, is, he has not killed that asura. He has subdued. He has broken the backbone, still he is alive there. One should note that you cannot totally eradicate ego or anova. You can subdue it. Yes, even in the last stage it becomes a bliss. So when when only you do into your Shiva Yoga, if you subdue the Sahangara, this Anava, then only your knowledge will try to sprout out, sprout out, sprout out, sprout out. This is the cosmic dance. Chittambaram, another name for Chillai. Chittam, your own mind space. Where is the mind? Mind is, mind you cannot see. This is astral. He dances there. His dance is there in the physical form as well as the astral form. That is why it is called a cosmic dance. In Nadraja Idol, you know, it is explaining the principles of all that. Near that, there is a Vishambara Ragasyam, they conduct Puja there. No idol. That is the reality. There is a Nirguna aspect of worship of Nadraja. The statue is the Saguna worship of Nadraja. So only in Siddhambaram, three types of worships are there. One, this is a idol of Nantraja, that is Ruba. This is Padika Linga worship, that is Aruba Ruba. And this Aruba, that is Siddhambara Regression, they are conducting puja in the room adjacent to that Nantraja. So moreover, this is, this is the history behind that. He has to convince that he showed his material, he proved his material before the Mima Saga in Tillai. And he started dancing there. He removed the ignorance of the Mima Saga, who were fully involved in rituals. They 100% believed, depended on, lived on rituals. He gave him the knowledge that rituals are peripheral. Only he is the final energy. Only he is doing everything in the form of dance, philosophic dance. They accepted and they worshipped there in Sile. He also explained that one should live where subdue you go. And only divine qualities will be expressed. And moreover, you should know the idol of Shiva in this Siddhambaran. He is one of the one not eight dances. This is the pleasing, blissful dance. This only expressed in Zen that you should know. But there are 108 poses. I have published a book with all these photos. Eternal Dance of Shiva. So this is the dance story behind it, the story also you cannot ignore because this is the starting point. This is the cause of the Nantraja statue. The science is only a result, the statue is the result and the findings of Zen is a second result. Who found, discovered or invented the statue, how it came. It was a, a Lord Shiva appeared in the dream of the king and he directed the sculptors to say, do like this and he corrected it many times, many times, many times and finally he accepted the form. So God expressed in his dream this form. The Mimam Saga saw this form. It happened in still life. This is the first cause of this. this. So you cannot dismiss spirituality. 
religion behind this uh, cosmic dance he, he, um, albert einstein himself he says that uh, science without religion is blind then why should you reject this history uh, portion of religious portion of spiritual portion of this uh, dance everybody accept that the dance is mystic mystic it involves geometry it involves time travel it involves cosmology it was a physics it is a, a quantum physics is also there they are ready to um, they are accept is a mystic dance they are not ready to accept the mysticism behind that so this is a starting but this is a cause for that dance moreover everybody is kind of concentrated on dance 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 only this after this dance call he came and danced after these uh, ten lives came these principles not represented i went to zen and saw that even now you can go and see in zen in geneva they are keeping the video and showing for exhibition first nataraja comes and dance, then kali comes and dance, then the ten lights are coming that's the final aruba state of the cosmic shiva cosmic shiva's dance so three stages are there one has to note many persons are uh, telling in youtube i have visited and discussed it with the scientists saw the idol present there saw the video of the findings lord the hydrogen collider they are they are also keeping there they are keeping pieces of the uh, tube they put inside the um yet they are keeping the machine portion of the collider everything is there i went there and saw and i have given youtube lectures in tamil malayalam and english also from there i explained the significance of dance some religious people who are uh, they say wrongly explaining the dance i i, I countered this explanation with a suitable reply and that, that has also been accepted by the international community now this is a story this is a starting point this is a cause of that uh, wonderful beautiful philosophy geometry not just statue and you, you can uh, bring this in you know, a dance in your guru mandala very very important that is the golden days of through the, the uh, lord nataraja you can bring this dance before your rakna chakra bring this dance to your rakna chakra you can put on the energy in muladhara swastana manivara anada vishudya atna sahasrara human land through this dance so the you can enjoy the blissful dance through shiva yoga through shiva yoga you can enjoy the blissful dance in yes guru mandala and lord the dance in guru mandala this is the infinite dance in guru mandala if you see this now uh, dance in your act now you will get induction and you will be connected with the solar system if you see this uh, the lord the lord nataraja's dance in guru mandala you will be connected with the infinity space under and above and above that is the real mukti the merger with the andam the solar system is happens in the akna level but the only mukti is when you take the when you visualize when you take the energy to sa guru mandala and you enjoy the blissful dance and move above that then only mukti so the nandraja idol speaks about saiva siddhanta fivefold activities nine principles of nandraja all the 22 24 bhavanas time travel and more and finally mukti he dances on the days called parashati he dances on the panchashara mantra the days has five steps the five steps are panchashara om namah shivaya thank you